Hey there, my funky VJ friends. Today we're having a look at bypassing effects in Resolume Arena and Avenue. While this might sound like I'm just going to show you the on and off switch, there are in fact some little tricks and techniques that we can pull off that you might not know about. So let's get started. Let's get the very basics out of the way first. How to bypass an effect. The answer is short and simple. Hit the bypass button over here. In this example, I have applied the cube tiles and colorize effects to my clip. By hitting the bypass button on the cube tiles, the effect gets disabled. This only disables the effect and not the entire chain, so the colorize effect is still applied. When an effect is bypassed, it is taken out of the render pipeline. This means that as far as your GPU is concerned, it doesn't exist. I have made this kind of silly example to demonstrate this. When I bypass all the bloom effects, we can see that my GPU load is chilling out again. We can bypass effects using a MIDI controller. Here I have added the shift RGB and distortion effects to a layer. Let's tweak this to the desired look. The idea is that I will be able to temporarily turn on this effect, like jamming with it with the press of a button. Now that I've got my look, we can do the MIDI part. I will start out by adding a MIDI shortcut to bypass the effect. I will set it to an inverted piano. Now I've got a nice playable effect with the press of a button. And that was it for this tutorial. I've gone ahead and made a couple more effects with the same technique. I will leave you with a little jam and I'll see you in the next one.